What's up, guys? Mike and Mike, Art of Alpha. So we talked about in the last video uh, some some reasons or things of like what a nice guy is, why it's a bad thing, why it's detrimental to your development, and what it does. Like being a nice guy puts you into bad relationships, into unhealthy situations, whether it's uh, dating or business type stuff. So the nice guy behaviors we need to learn to what to do to overcome them and to get into better relationships and to value ourselves better so some of the things that you can do so what you can do to overcome these negative sort of nice guy habits and and get into healthy relationships and not have girls use you and and um like business stuff uh, fail you want to take charge of your life and and become someone of value and someone that you respect so what you do is you need to set boundaries. So you need to have things that you'll tolerate. If you're going out with some girl and she's not treating you the way you want to be treated according to your boundaries, then you need to cut it off and you need to be willing to move on. We talked about this in a video before. You have to be willing to move on and not stay with someone that's not improving, helping you to improve. Yes, and the other thing too is, so you want to have boundaries, you want to have goals, and you need to uh, stop negative self-talk. So if you talk bad about yourself, things that I used to do all the time was say, say something would happen. I would always go negative towards myself. I would say, oh, I'm stupid. Oh, that's dumb. Or this person doesn't like me because of this. And really, you have to be your own best friend. You can't have negative self-talk all the time. You have to respect yourself. You have to have boundaries, respect yourself, believe in yourself, um, increase your self-esteem. And you want to have goals, purpose, a passion. So one of the things that me and Mike have gotten into lately is uh, photography, videography. And we use that as something that can that we aspire to and, and try to improve on and build our goals and because of that we're on a path uh, on a purpose on a path trying to build our YouTube channel so that way if there is a girl uh, say it's not treating us good we don't feel like we need to put her on a pedestal and she's the only thing we have going on in our lives we have, we have other things going on in our life and we don't just need her we don't need to cling to her or cling to a bad relationship um, so if you, you want to have a lot of things going on that you can work towards that you can then I improve on. So Mike maybe can talk about this too, is uh, having goals, having boundaries, having a belief in yourself. Um, that's going to crush these nice guy, needy guy uh, behaviors. A lot of times these guys that we talk to, our clients, they say, oh, I'm feeling sad because a girl broke up with me. Um, and you know, Mike talked to a guy the other day where a girl broke up with him and he was trying to struggle on how to move on. And a way to move on is you find activities, you find things to do like salsa dancing, like uh, photography, videography, martial arts, things that you're interested in, and that'll pull you out of that neediness, that nice guy rut. Um, so Mike can maybe talk about some of his experiences on how to get over those nice guy behaviors. Yeah, to get so to get back to where you were, but maybe you were how you like maybe you were in that good place before. Maybe you were somewhere where you felt like uh, before you were dating or you were trapped in that relationship that you were, you were feeling like alpha like you used to be. So you want to get back to that. So from the nice guy standpoint of view, um, the goal, like the old goals that I used to have, which is stuff like we're doing now, um, pushing the social limits that I used to, I used to not push. I'm um, getting back to that. Just like I say, I'm doing this videography stuff. It's, it's helped out a lot. Um, like working out, fitness. Working, yeah. Working out, fitness, going back to jujitsu, uh, traveling more. That's a huge thing is we're, we're going to be traveling a lot. Uh, that's going to be coming up soon in our, in our videos. Um, I don't know what yeah, else. You want to have experience, yeah. That, uh, it's gonna help. Yeah, it's gonna help with further with the other relationships. But the uh, big thing too is with the goals is uh, you're setting yourself up. So maybe you had goals you had set before and you pushed them aside for the girl, uh, for for the relationship that you had. We wanted you get you to get back on track for that. So either you pick them back up or you might have new goals that you set because you're in a different place or a different state of mind. Maybe you're a little older, you, you don't feel the same way as you did in like your mid or, or late 20s and now that you're in your 30s, like you're looking for financial freedom or you just want to uh, travel more. So you want to set yourself up for that. But you want to find someone that fits your lifestyle or what you want to do. Not not fit their lifestyle, what's going on with them, because that doesn't matter. If they don't work for you, it's okay to say no. It's okay to step back and take a breather. And remember, I'm you know, I'm worth it too. It's it's about me. I'm gonna have a little me time. So Yeah. So what Mike's talking about is boundaries, saying things that you're not gonna tolerate. Um, having the me time, which means you're gonna do things for yourself. Um, you're not gonna just follow someone else and just, you know, be clingy and needy because you have other things going on. You can't be needy if you wanna 
um, if you're working towards something, towards building something, and if you you have experiences like travel and things like that, they're gonna they're gonna crush those nice guy behaviors and those nice guy habits. Guys get needy because they have nothing else going on. So you want to have a complete life, have other interests, things going on, so you don't fall into that needy nice guy behavior. So that's some tips for today, guys. We have some way more videos coming out all about like crushing this nice guy behavior because that's kind of the thing that we had that held us back. Um, we're trying to overcome all that. And we have, in, in many respects, um, overcome all the nice guy behaviors that we've had before. So we're really um, just trying to crush all that. So uh, we have more videos coming out. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Comment down below. We're going to get out of this busy, hectic mall. We're going to go somewhere else and shoot. Hopefully the audio came in good for you guys. But if you have any comments, leave them down below. Any questions, email us. Uh, Instagram us. We're going to be starting a new Instagram. So make sure you uh, go check that out. When I get it up, I'll leave it down below. Thank you to all the new subscribers. See you in the next video.